You can reduce your risk for some of them. You can certainly improve your skin. There are certain skin conditions. I may, um, there's a condition we call acanthosis nigricans. This is kind of brownish discoloration frequently noticed on the neck, under the arms, sometimes over the knuckles, on the hands, sometimes in the groin area that is related to too much insulin in your blood. And that's triggered by the body trying to clear the high blood sugar levels. Now, if you get your blood sugar under control and you exercise properly and you diet properly at the same time, you can literally make this brown discoloration go away. So that's one condition that clearly uh, proper control of your diabetes has an impact. Now there is another condition that where the diabetes is totally out of control, the levels of some fats called triglycerides in your blood is markedly up elevated. And this is a medical emergency in my mind you may develop some things that come out as many red, yellow, or brownish bumps. And if you don't control this condition, you can wind up with uh, a thing called pancreatitis, so inflammation of your pancreas. And this is very serious. Now, getting your diabetes quickly under control and getting your triglyceride level under control actually clears that skin. So that's another example where you actually can clear the skin. Now, of course, if you have fungal infections of the nails, you can treat it with the oral medication called terbinafin, followed up with maintenance treatment with your over-the-counter antifungal medicines. There is a product called clotrimazole. There's myconazole, some of them are also prescription items. So what I would do is oral medication to get the fungus infection cleared from toenails and fingernails and feet, and then I would follow it up with maintenance creams or antifungal powders. So that you can treat. Bacterial infections, of course, are treated with antibiotics. Um, but things that are related to blood vessel changes in the skin tend to be irreversible. So the spots that, the brown spots, the thumbnail size brown spots depressed on the lower legs and the front part of your lower leg, those are permanent. The necrobiosis lipoidica, you can improve and treat, as I mentioned before, with the medications, uh, some of them work initially. If you can't, then I talked about two medicines that I would try. Those skin lesions can be improved, but you're still going to see the leftover remnants of changes that have occurred. So to answer the question of can some of these skin changes be improved, there are a few that can be cleared. Some of them are improved and others are permanent.